What's up ninjas, it's your boy Onion here back with another FIFA Mobile video Pele is coming to FIFA Mobile Yes guys, EA announced this like 12 hours ago It's official, when the icons will refresh, Pele will be among them It would be a really good opportunity to invest If, if market wouldn't be a mess at the moment However, in this video I will show you what I think are the best investments But before I'm gonna show you the investments I just want to take the time out and say that they are risky considering considering latest market mess where cards don't sell bots, EA bots don't buy the cards, it's such a fucked up situation but I've seen some cards rise in price so it might be the case with newer investments, maybe only the old investments are the ones that are fucked up. So. Considering Pele is coming to FIFA Mobile, I think we have a couple of options to invest. First of all, you can invest in Brazilian players and in higher rated Brazilian players, of course. Naldo is a really good one. He's an 85 center back team of the Ronaldo. Um, if you can snipe him below 700k or around 800k, that would be a great snipe. When I say snipe, I don't mean about the buy now price because that's impossible. Just go ahead and bid on him, all right? I don't have coins at the moment. I have some players listed. Unfortunately, I'm not sure if they will sell, but if they will sell, I will try to invest in a couple of players. Another investment could be Neymar because his price went down a bit considering season one attack more rewards when everybody receives so high many high rated players. He is 2.4 at the moment. He could be a good investment. Again, you kind of need his position to be needed. So it is a gamble, but at 2.4 milli, it's hard to lose too much on Neymar. However, really good investment that I think everybody should think of. Think of is Neto. He's a goalkeeper and all squads guys need goalkeepers. He is 1.8 milli at the moment. He might be even less, he might, we might see him at 1.7 or something. Uh, if you beat him at 1.6 that, then that's great. Um, and his position will be needed for sure since he's a goalkeeper. Again, don't invest too much in him because you don't know what's gonna happen. If they're gonna have to duplicate the cards again, we have no idea. But I think this is a reasonable investment that can't go wrong. Uh, it's hard for him to drop, so you're risk, risking maximum tax. If we want to check up high, even higher rated cards, then Dani Alves could be used, could be needed. I already have two of him that I bought and I can't sell. But getting Dani Alves around 4 milli or four, even for maximum 4.5, 4 no more than 4.5, could be a good investment. The problem with him is that he'll not, he's not getting sold at the moment which means the risk of having him is pretty pretty high. I wouldn't invest in gold cards, I would invest in as high rated cards as possible because we all know Pele will need a high rating. And that's pretty much it guys. I don't want to make this a long video or to give us too many examples. I think Neto is one of the best ones. Neymar could be really good as well. Even Dani Alves team up there if, if he can be sold. But I think Neto from these three, I think Neto is one of the best high rated Brazilians to invest in. So yeah guys, this is pretty much it. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know what you think about this video in the comments down below. Share if you think my content is worthy. And until next time, I'm out. Peace.